Hey guys, welcome back. Yes, you see a Walgreens bag in front of you. Sorry, my light is having menopause right now. I don't do hauls that often, but I thought I would show you guys some new goodies that I've gotten from the drugstore before I put them away. Um, most of this stuff was Rite Aid and Walgreens. That is it. So to get started, most of these things I have not used. I think I've only actually used one product in this bag. So, seriously, my light is going through some stuff right now. So let's get started. Black Radiance has come out with a load of new products. And one of those products being limited edition shimmer eyeshadow and a primer as well. They came out with four colors. And of course, I only wanted the purple, but then I felt like the other ones would, you know, be there by themselves. And I couldn't have that. They were only $2.99, but of course, if you're in Rite Aid and you've got money saved not money saved up but like the points or the cash back whatever that is called and you get your 20 percent off um at three dollars a pop i think i actually only spent a total of about six bucks with everything that i got because i had so many points up on my thing i practically didn't pay for anything so the first one is called violet it's purple and they all come with a primer so I'm gonna have quite a bit of eye primers <laughs> so let's open this up so this is kind of an unboxing now these things I hate these kind of products because I always feel like I'm gonna break my nails as I do it now let's see the primer okay okay it looks actually like the um, Too Faced Shadow Insurance. That's how it looks. And there it is on there. And here is the pigment. Ah, oh, and it has that cover. So I'm not gonna try to fight that and get that out because I'm gonna break a nail and all, or I'm just gonna make a mess. So they do have that insert there and it's keeping the pigment from falling out. Looks like you get a decent amount of product, and like I said, if you have a point set up, you really won't be paying anything. Next color I got is hot pink. Then I got the blue, which is called cobalt, which is a really pretty blue, and it looks like it's true to the, the picture that's there. And the final one is orange and that's what it looks like yay now also from black radiance they have these new little trios that are out and i think there was five of them let's see what i pull out <laughs> yeah there were five okay so the first one is the only thing in this whole bag that i actually used is called correct and it's the green set. Next up is the purple set called Ambition. Isn't that pretty? That'll probably be the next one I wear. Next one is called On Point, which is the more neutral with the orange and the brown and then your simple champagne kind of color. Then they have the pink one called Cute. I don't know why they call it cute, but it's pink. Just call it pink, pink is not cute. And then the blue one, which is called Alluring. So Black Radiance definitely got some new eye products out there for you guys, and these as well were $2.99. But um, yeah, guys, use your points. <laughs> Next up were just see some of some things from Wet and Wild. If I got them all, let me get them all out. Wet and Wild. And I think that's it. <laughs> okay, so from Wet and Wild, I'm trying to get a love for liquid liners. I'm trying, but I've heard 
quite some good stuff about Wet n Wild. So I got their H2O liquid eyeliner and their Mega Liner. This is a new shade. This is the black with glitter in it. So it's called uh, Black Sparkle and the H2O is Ultra Black. And I got those. Then I got two of these quad thingamaduzits. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Quince, I guess. And this one is called Floral Values. Of course, you guys know I'm going to get the purple. And then I got the Naked Truth, which is another nudie palette. You know, every brand has to have their nudie palette. Also got a pencil sharpener because mine decided to die on me for some odd reason. <laughs> then I got the two um, eight pan palettes that they have. And this one is called Walking the Red Carpet. So this is more of your browns and your golds in there. And of course, come on guys, was there even a doubt? <laughs> I got the flirting at the after party. What's funny is when they come out with these things, I can never get them. I'm always always i repeat always on a hunt for these things and my rite aid and walgreens um these all the wet and wild stuff i showed you guys i actually got from walgreens so these things were right there they had just put out the display but mind you the stuff that came before this we can't find at all don't have i got a few um revlon little things i think i think i only got two of them no i got three so i got a few of the revlon quads which is odd because i normally don't gravitate towards revlon eyeshadows so i thought i'd give them a try and this is sea mist this one is free spirit which i, I like this kind of blue over here and this one is exotic you see that bright yellow in there guys I might take this one with me to Mexico. Next up, I got two Mab was it only two? Yeah. Two Maybelline quads. One, two, three, four. Yeah, okay. <laughs> they're quads. And this one, they're both new. Apparently, this one is called Lavender Smokes. So you've got some light lilac and lavender colors there. And this one is called Electric Blue. I only got it. I like I didn't even notice there was a purple up there. I saw that blue and I said I have to have that blue in my life so that's why I got that blue um, then I got I don't have much from LA colors but these caught my attention they were in Walgreens which is I thought was odd because I never see LA colors in Walgreens I never see these products except for in beauty supply stores but Walgreens had them so I got these two and do they have names okay so this one is Mongolia and I think that purple right there, that's a pretty color. And this one is called Sunflower. So you've got your, your rusty colors in here. And that middle color caught me, caught my attention. So that is why I got that. Oh, sorry, there was a third one. And this one is called Forget Me Not. And I just don't know why I got this one. I'm not attracted to any of these colors, but I do see a lot of people using them, so I guess I will give them a try too. So I got the Ruby Kisses 3D Face Corrector. I used to use this as a concealer, which I still do sometimes. It's a great consistency, great coverage, um, buildable, and yeah. But I actually wanted... Um, a, a cream contouring product. I wanted a, a product to contour with that wasn't a foundation. And if that makes any sense to you guys. <laughs> so I said, wait, let me grab this. And apparently it's a new and improved formula. So we'll check this out. Now for concealer, I use level 11, I believe. Um, this is level 13, which looks like that. I'm hoping you guys can see that and then this one is level 12 and as you can see they're 499 and these are actually in the beauty supply store so I was happy to find those and 
from Magnolia. You see the size of this, guys? This is a body illuminator or face, it's illuminator. You can use it all over. You can use it on your cheekbones, everywhere, basically to get a gorgeous glow. Um, and this is from Magnolia Makeup. I also got some lippies from them and I have pictures of them on my Instagram. So if you wanna see those swatch of those lip products from them, you can go there. The link to my Instagram will be down below. And this is a body illuminator, which I blame Little Pumpkin Pie. Is it 05? 07? <laughs> I don't remember the number. But um, Jackie O, love you girl. This, I saw her use this in um, one of her recent videos and I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. And you see how much product you get in this jar? Wow, that's cool. Kind of reminds me of the old school MAC pigments. Um, even though by the time I got into makeup, MAC wasn't using these jars anymore. Yeah. And then finally, another liquid liner. And this one is from Milani. This is called, the color is Everlast. This is just a black one. And then this is a supposed to be a colored mascara from Nika K. Water resistant. And it's just a purple one. I don't think it has a color name. Yep, it just says purple. And again, that's a colored mascara from Nika K. And I think that's it for my drugstore haul. Yep, that is it, guys. So... Thank you so much for tuning in, and I'm going to go ahead and put all this stuff away. I'm going to try. Pray for me. Bye. I totally forgot this was <laughs> this was on my lap, guys, this whole time. This is another Wet n Wild one. It says new. I don't know how new this is. I got a feeling like this came out a while ago, and I'm just finding it. And this one is called Poster Child. And those are some very pretty, vibrant colors. Bye.